Supra. Kwa nini Supra? Watu walipenda Supra na hizo like the African shit, the African outfit in the world. Ankara. Yeah, Ankara shit. Uh, a fashion trend I'll bring back is the hipsters, the white legged hipsters. I think they were really cool. Yeah. They yeah. I would bring back safari boots. Why? I really love them and I begged my dad to buy them for me so I'd wear them with heels and to church. And I loved them. Mm -hmm. Safari <laughs> <laughs> I think for me. And um, I, I was born hippie. And I think from a very young age, people would talk about my hips. So when hipsters came, it was something meant for me. Unfortunately, my mom used to buy the ones that have very big waists. Now that I'm an adult, I can't buy that, but I want a hipster. Fashion <laughs> 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 Do you guys remember that time, that era we used to wear snapbacks and uh, ding dongs and uh, ray pants? Eh? You remember ray pants? So that, those pilot shirts, carrot trousers, eh? that era was beautiful. Eh? Jeans, mwani, carrot, japo, mwani, pilot shirts, kona ka. Ile nini, ile scarf. Kushaba na yu scarf, alafu vwai na ray pants, a snapback. Kwa kunyu watu sasa. Cowboy dress code. Cowboy dress code. Yeah. Why? As soon as I saw him, he is calm. It's a peaceful friend. I can say so. I have 
in thinking about doing mentorship programs and just trying to be, I don't know, I want to call myself Urania Najita Fadi. Life coach, there's this one inspirational thing God, when you're gonna come in high school. Those speakers, I, I, I want to be that and I want to be known for that later on in life. I have a career to rotate, so I don't think I'll answer that question now. But. I would be famous be a big dog lover. I love dogs. And I think um, if I had the opportunity, I'd have a compound with like 50 dogs, so that would only really make me famous. Famous? Ah. Because when we were there, why do not film director? So you just know, maybe cameras and everything, just that's my playing so, yeah. And uh, generally, uh, an activist, a social, uh, an activist that deals with the scope where we deal with empowerment. Uh, generally, for the people who have been ignored in the past, promoting them, so yeah, so just generally being an activist. I got it from my grandma. Nobody makes you sad. Hmm? Best advice. Uh, everyone has a story to tell, so always be kind. Being kind is key. Just be show kindness to it. Doesn't matter. The actual trial is that and always uh, just do your best and don't let go and take up the rest and that is it always works out in the end. Good vibes. Be be yourself. Always be yourself. Best advice that I've ever had. That go hard or go home. <laughs> <laughs> means love. Uh, my first name, Basil. Okay, I was born on December 2nd. The same day that Saint Basil the Great, the Catholic, decided to love the Catholic scandal and I me. was actually a uh, big. Yeah, so that's why I'm like Basil. So I'm Basil the Great. And uh, so I'm great, as you can see. It's not, it's not a flex, it's that. This Basil the Great, I have a second name, Kesh. No. The middle name, Rito. Rito means to wait. So I was supposed to be born on November 21st, not December 2nd. So they waited. So that's the name, Rito. Okay, sad name, guys. So the name is Jessica, and um, its origin is from Hebrew. It means God given. Mm. So I think that's a blessing when it's born. Such a powerful name. Okay, meaning of my name. You know, I've, I've struggled to get the literal meaning of my name. Mm -hmm. Agere and Sigunga. But uh, Sigunga generally is drawn to somewhere in Tanzania. I've, I've never found the meaning. But Agere, what I know about Agere is that Agere means some building. So I know very well that they thought of that Agere will be building something in the near future. That's what I'm feeling right now. My name is Sonia. The first to wisdom. A polite girl. And, um. <laughs> knowledgeable. Skilled. Everyday matters. Dictionary mm -hmm. mm -hmm. here. <laughs> I think she has known that today. Uh -oh. <laughs> <Drama. laughs> okay. 
my my name means Helen means shining light and Joki in Kikuyu means someone who keeps coming back. So also please watch a movie called Helen of Troy. Yes. You will see.